How are we doing everyone? Sam here, United People's TV live reaction to the Champions League draw which has happened and Manchester United have drawn Barcelona in the quarter-final of the Champions League for this year. Barcelona. Let me know what you think about that in the comments below. But, you know, the plum draw would have been Porto. That went to Liverpool. They're in the semi-finals. Then you would have said Ajax. That went to Juventus. But Manchester United have been drawn against Barcelona. Lionel Messi, Luis Suarez and co. That's who United will face in the quarter-final. Let me know what you think about that in the comments. But it's a hard game for United. But I didn't expect United to be here at this point in the Champions League anyway. I thought we were going out to PSG, so did everybody else. But we're through to the quarterfinals and, well, the new Camp, eh? Ole Gunnar Solskjaer going back to the new Camp. That's a fucking story in itself. That's where he won the treble for United back in 1999. And 20 years on, he's taken United there in the quarterfinals of the Champions League as manager. That's romantic in itself. But United, we're underdogs. We were underdogs against PSG, but we somehow came through that. And now we've got to go and do it against Barcelona. I don't really know what to think other than fuck it. You know, if United can beat PSG, then we can go and beat Barcelona. But whew, we are massive underdogs going into this game. And Barcelona, you know, have quietly, while Real Madrid have been melting away, they've just been doing what they're doing. Absolutely smash past Leon. In their, in their, was it, round of 16 game, won 5-1, I think, Messi scoring two and got two assists as well. But, pfft, Barcelona, eh? It could have been Porto. It could have been Ajax. It could have been Spurs. I think United fans would have, would have taken all three of those. But instead, it's Barcelona. I mean, you've got to be excited by it rather than fearful because of what happened at PSG. I don't think United should have been at this point in the competition. I never, ever expected it. So it's, it's a free hit in that respect. Solskjaer has already done more than anybody would have expected to as Manchester United manager in the Champions League. And if that miracle can happen in Paris, and in 1999 that miracle could happen in Barcelona, why can't that miracle happen again, this time in 2019 in the Champions League quarterfinals? Let me know your predictions in the comments below. And the semi-final draw is also done. So Manchester United know that if we get past Barcelona, we're going to face Liverpool in the semi-final of the Champions League. I can't get my head around how big that fixture would be. I was nervous enough playing Liverpool in the Europa League, let alone playing them in the semi-final of the Champions League. But United have got a serious, serious job on their hands to make that match happen. We've got to get past Barcelona, who aren't infallible. It's not like the Barcelona of 2009 and 2011 that completely swept us aside. The Barcelona team now does have weaknesses, but United do have more weaknesses. But let me know what you think about that draw in the comments below. Is it the worst draw United could have got? I don't think it is. I think Liverpool and Man City are both tougher teams, and maybe even Juventus with Cristiano Ronaldo. But Man United are playing Barcelona in the quarterfinals of the Champions League. Let me know what you think about that in the comments below, as always. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. And if we get through, we're fucking playing Liverpool in the semi-final. How about that?